welcome to vlogmas day 15 um it is evening time so do excuse any noise in the background um due to family members are i think gaming downstairs at the moment um this is going to come up maybe a few times actually but possibly not into too much detail but basically my mum was um rushed into hospital she collapsed um, so, um, everything's just gone to pot, um, with phone calls and, um, everything that's going on. So, I'm not going to say any more about it at the moment, um, but i am still got things, little things that I'm ticking off my list. So I know a lot of people are going to say, and I'll probably repeat this, um, don't, you know, worry about vlogmas and everything, but... At the moment, I'm not putting Christmas on hold. Um, whether it will change, I don't know. Um, but things that still are on my list to tick off, and one of them is the stockings. Um, funny enough, some stockings I didn't mind not returning, what I call not the special ones, but the special ones where they're allocated to certain members of the family, I do like them back and probably infested in them not just um money but also um memories if that makes sense i i know i've got a lot because a lot have come back but i think the most recent one was i don't think it, it was even last year was this mini mouse one which I still haven't put up um i might even just put some um carrier bags or something in there or tissue paper just to you know um bunch it out a bit and maybe just um put it on a hook um, at the mirror so there's that so I'm just going to go through as I said I don't know if anybody else has got traditions um, where um, they've got certain stockings for everybody you might notice and this has come up so some of it's going to be familiar these I got from Tesco's these must be 15 20 odd years old maybe even more because I've got um, four of them I've got two of the penguin I've got one in red and one in green and then I've got two reindeers one is in the green and one is in the red so our sons are like this one is Daniel's that one's Matthew's our sons this is hubby's and that's mine they're that old that we've even um, lost the cord out of them but um, that can be threaded one of those jobs that keeps putting off so this is basically it um, this is the box that was returned to us and uh, came down when we got the Christmas decorations. That is the um, case that I use as a Christmas Eve box for our granddaughter. <coughs> Excuse me. And these are what come back. So that came back. That's our son. That's our daughter-in-law's. Um, I've had special um, stockings for a for our granddaughter before but I think what it was um they weren't big enough basically when it started um putting things in so she had this one last year be good Santa knows everything so um yeah it, it might differ a little bit but a lot of stuff goes in her Christmas Eve box um I've tucked over her name but I did actually order this um her first Christmas I so say she's five now um, it's got a name on Merry Christmas, Lots of Love, Santa. It's got the reindeer. So that's hers. And then one's for um, other family members or that I'm not so precious about, these sort. And I remember I've brought no end of these sort of ones um, sort of on clearance after Christmas. Oh, that's something else that came back in the um, box. I'm sure this had um, Hubby's birthday cake in last year. Um, is this tin and these tins if I remember right came from Poundland so I can put that in case anything needs to go to anybody's home besides I've got plastic um, containers so I've got a lot of these ho 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 this one I ordered a few years ago now um, I'm not sure if it was used last year because um, I used those um, boxes that I got from um, Poundland um, it's got Christopher, obviously caravan and everything. Merry Christmas, love, hugs and snowflake kisses. Denise. So, yeah. That's mainly if I get in quite a lot of clothing. Um, in the past, I say sometimes it depends on, you know, how much 
um, stuff needs to be used. I've got some of these. Looks like I've got a couple. I don't know if they're the same, possibly. It's just refreshing what I've got, even though I might repeat it every year and you've seen some of this before. It's nice to go through everything. So I've got Dear Santa, oh my God, you've read my text. And is that, that one looks as though it's not been used. Um, but this one's, um, this one's just, yeah, this one's smaller. And this one says, Dear Santa, I've been very, very, very good most of the time. I've got a feeling we use that one for our granddaughter at some point as well. I might actually, um, because it's a sack, I might, and has it still got a pile? I was thinking about using this actually to cover my cushion, um, if it'll fit in. Maybe I'll do that, I'm not sure. That's another thing. And then I got purple, say, one time they were ridiculous prices like 50p and 20p and things like that this one actually our son's 30 now this was his it's one of his it's quite stained mind you but it's as i say i'm going to try and get that cleaned up if i can because that could also come in here and then i think it like i was thinking his and hers so i got it in the blue got it in the purple and yeah i've got hats in here and yeah i got this it's still got the tag look reduced um, half price a pound because I'd seen it before where you've got a box and you cover it as though it's brickwork and you fill things like this in make like a chimney fill that up that goes on top and like Santa's falling down the chimney type thing um, never got around to it I bought that about th that was even before um, lockdown and I've got different Hats. I'm glad they're in this box, not in the other one. So, so I've got another hat, even that, because that white actually help with a game I'm hopefully going to do for Christmas Eve. I've sort of said to everybody, as far as I know, it's going ahead. Um, so I might use those hats. Another idea you can always do is these hats. They may, and I have done it um, ages ago. Um, is fill them, then stitch them up, and you've got a nice mini cushion um, with the pom pom mat on. So it's just an idea. Oh, and here's another one. So yeah, they'd be handy. This one is like Scandinavian type thing. I do like this. And failing, to, if I don't use this, I can cut this down even. Maybe like that. Make small stockings actually out of that because I've got the back in as well so I can pin it and re-stitch it so I might do that with that one um, well, we've got another hat so that's going to be handy for game hopefully for Christmas Eve and these I haven't bothered I don't know if they're all here probably not maybe this was an odd one that got separated these are the Santa legs that used to go on the coffee tables which won't be happening this time and I've got this one so sometimes I forget about these things. That would be good for Christmas Eve. Um, for the photo booth props. So at least I've got that. Um, I do like the rustic ones. This must be maybe a Poundland one. I do like these sort of things. Express Elf Mail. Please deliver enclosed presents by the 25th of December. And I do like these Hessian type ones. And this is something that still hasn't been used. Do excuse the rustle. Now I, I actually forgot about these. Maybe I can use these actually. I think I must have taken one out the wrapper to show. Um, with um, place settings. And put some sweets or cookies or anything in these. I must still have quite a few of them. And um, have those as place settings even. Or have them um, you know, on the table Christmas Eve with little... Um, gifts in so they can take those home with them so I might do that because I'm sure I've had those even before lockdown so I've had those probably about three years as well so there's going to be a few mini videos like this um, just you know sort of share my things I've got um, my Christmas clothing I've also got my Christmas pajamas 
Christmas jewellery and everything like that. So I'm afraid this is all that's going to be on today's video. Very tired. I'm cooking dinner and um, so it's been quite a stressful day. So hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.